Our top story this morning, Texas civic leaders and immigrant advocacy groups are urging President Biden to expand work authorization for long term undocumented migrants and mixed status families. This includes immigrants who were brought into the United States illegally as children and are protected from de deportation, otherwise known as dreamers. Transition opportunities is common sense and it will tamp down inflation. It's also good economics. We have 9.5 million open jobs in the United States. It's good politics. 10.6 million U.S. citizens throughout the country live in a mixed status family. Well, this all comes amid growing concerns of the future status of Senate Bill 4, which, as we've mentioned on many occasions, would allow law enforcement to arrest migrants suspected of crossing the border illegally. And while some lawmakers like Congresswoman Veronica Escobar are calling on Biden to extend work permits for those undocumented, Republican Irene Arbendariz Jackson says she worries that extending work permits would hurt everyone. We're going to hurt Americans, especially in a, a, a city like El Paso where the, the wages are very low, the medium income is one of the lowest in the nation, and now we're going to flood the market with labor? Now, if work permits are extended, they will not necessarily protect people like dreamers and their families should as before become law. And we're seeing two sides here. Yeah. Uh, one side saying, hey, there's enough jobs here. We yep. could use some workforce. And then the other side saying, oh, no, we're going to overcrowd the job market with so many people if we give out all these work permits. And not just here, but around the country as well. Places even as far away as Chicago. The Chicago mayor just last week saying, hey, we need to extend work permits to these people. It's happening all over the place. And like you said, we heard from Representative mm -hmm. Amidadas Jackson on one side of that issue. I think the other side of this issue is, hey, if we get work permits out to these people, the quicker they can get out of shelters, the quicker mm -hmm. we can open up space, and we can, the quicker we can get these people on their feet and contributing to society. Right, so there are definitely two sides, and then as before, as always, seemingly to throw a wrench into things and causing more questions and more headaches where I'm sure they lawmakers thought this wouldn't happen. But anyway, we will keep an eye on this as it continues to roll on.